So I've got this Malacat uh, electronic xylophone thing, and um, it's been stored for a bit, and I uh, recently got it out, and it doesn't look too good uh, from storage. It's uh, It's got some of the glue seeping out from under the bars, and it's getting all nasty. So uh, I'm going to try and clean it up. And some of the bars have started to peel away. Actually, a lot of the bars have started to peel away. So I'm going to try to fix that as well. Uh, so today, I'm going to try to get it kind of apart, uh, get the bars off of it that, that are, that are uh, in need of some attention, and clean it up as much as I can, and then put it all back together. OK, so after letting it cool down for a bit, on the master one here, it looks like most of the bars the exception of a just a couple here are pretty well attached to that one's obviously going to need some attention the control ones there look all right so it's just it looks like there's a little bit this one might be okay one's good good that one's gonna need some attention and the one on the end so not too bad this one it's got a bunch so these two are both bad this one this one this one this one this one this one they're basically all coming off every single one so I'm probably just going to take all of these all completely off so it makes it easier to clean it up because uh, otherwise I'm going to have to get in here with a toothbrush or something to get in all between all the bars like I'm going to have to do on this one because um, there's only a couple that need to be reattached. And I've got some double-sided tape and hopefully that will work. I've already reattached one bar. I can't remember which one. Hopefully it wasn't one of these. Um, uh, I've already reached. I think it was one of these. I think it was this one. I use a double-sided tape and I think it worked okay. So we're going to try that and hopefully it will work. And then I'm going to use uh, some foam, uh, sort of um, sort of foam board insulation. I'm going to put on top of this uh, under the cover so that this is insulated from the sun uh, when the sun gets on it so that uh, it won't happen again while it's in use. Okay, this is it with all the bars removed. So all of these rubberized adhesive backed bars removed, which were all peeling off. And all of this gunk that is between the bars is all the melted glue that seeped out from under the bars mixed with whatever dust got on it so it's kind of a mess so I'm gonna get some stuff on it and uh, some various uh, high-tech tools and clean it up and then I'm gonna reattach all the bars All right, that's it all cleaned up. Ready to put the bars back on. It's all just this smooth surface now. And uh, all the goo is gone. 
All right, well, there's one bar attached, and it's pretty firmly attached, so hopefully it's going to go well here. So I'm going to put the rest of them on there and uh, see what it looks like. All right, there it is, all put back together, all the bars stuck back down, cleaned up. Let's see, we got all the gunk out from between the bars. And they're all stuck down pretty good now. Hopefully, they won't come off again. Now I just have to set it back up and test it and make sure I didn't break it. All right, so you might notice a little bit of a difference between the one I cleaned and reattached all the bars and the other one here. When I get more of the double-sided tape that I used to fix all of these bars, I will uh, disassemble this one and clean it all up. Always assuming that this one stays intact and these uh, bars don't come off again. But I'm going to call this side at least done. And uh, this side, they're not too bad. They're still attached. But obviously, it still needs to be cleaned up pretty good. So I'll get some more of the double-sided tape. And then we'll uh, clean this side up too. All right, so this is where we are with this one. This is the master unit. Uh, all but these four actual note keys, which still seem to be adhered pretty well. And the two little control keys here, which aren't adhe adhered as well, but um, I'm gonna, I'll redo them if I, if I have enough uh, double-sided tape when I'm done. Uh, but in the meantime, I think that's enough to get in there pretty well and clean most of it. And then, uh, reaffix these bars back on afterwards with the double sided tape. So let's get it cleaned up. Okay, there she is, all cleaned up, and, well, hopefully working, I'm going to test it here. All right, so there she is, all cleaned up. Working. No more crud in between the bars, and all the, uh, Bars are nice and solid. So, successful project. We'll have to see how well that double-sided tape holds. Um, so maybe I'll do a follow-up in the future, but uh, I think she looks pretty good.